the one and only Peter Spanos. Great to have you here, mate. Oh, good, good to be here. Thank you. All right. So tell us about your, um, your upbringing as a Greek in this Australian country and how music entered your life. Because for a lot of the Greek boys growing up, it's mainly Greek school, studying, and the whole shebang. So tell us about that. That's exactly what happened. Uh, I grew up in, in the West. Uh, I was born in Maribel, grew up in Della Chill. Me too. That's good. And, yeah, thank you. And, um, you know, um, basically, my mum told me a story. When she was pregnant to me, I was the firstborn. Uh, for her to relax, uh, and she put music on. Music, yes. And basically, that must have filtered straight to her tummy, into my system. And from a five-year-old, um, growing up doing, uh, I guess, plays at school, mm. I always recited everyone else's lines. Wow. So I had a passion for the arts. The arts, yes. So music was part of it, and it was always in me. Um, okay. Of course, education is very, very important. Um, I went to a good school. My father never allowed me to play music. So I've always sung, always air guitar until I probably was about 16. Mm. And then I started uh, getting lessons. So I worked two jobs uh, and basically it filtered through uh, into teaching and writing songs. Uh, I'm a songwriter. Uh, I've done a couple of albums. Um, I had big contracts offered when I was 21 and oh, 30, wow. but I didn't take oh, them because I had this Greek mentality of family, yes. children, you know, future because um, I didn't want to be a bum on the street and left busking and you now wasting that opportunity. So I Absolutely. try to balance my life through education, mm. work and the arts. And growing up Greek, when you say your mom played Greek music to you, or was it English music? Well, she played Greek music always, but I never had a passion for Greek music. Okay. Uh, it was very folky. Uh, I loved uh, all genres, in particular rock music. I loved the band Kiss, my oh, favorite yeah. band. And oh. I was in Greece actually, mm. when I was a 10 year old. I was walking down the streets of my sister and my mom and I saw the Dynasty album, 1979, and songs like Sean Knows Something, I Was Made For Loving You were being played. Oh, uh, yes. And I said, I just got to have that album. Mm, that changed my life. Album, yes. 21 onwards, tell us about those experiences. What was it like for you? Well, weren't that many, actually, because, you know, I played until about 30. 30, yes. And it was more original music. It wasn't okay. about making money. Yeah, it was okay. about, um, I taught students. You taught students. At my parents' house in Delhi Chill, and uh, then I got married and taught in Lugano. Know, and also yes. Five Dog Music School as well. A couple of years ago, I decided, uh, I'm mid-40s, that enough's enough, mm. you know? I've got a family, I've got kids, I want to go out there and do it again. Yeah? Yes, and um, t today, you know, we've got a band called Rock City Saints. Three of us are Greek heritage. Um, one is from Mytilene. So, oh, well, yes, because yeah, we're here, Mytilene House in Canterbury. And, um, but yeah, we're very good guys. And, you know, it's, you know the Greeks are very passionate people. Uh, but there's a lot of love and a lot of respect. So, so the music is, you know, I tell my kids that you can do anything. Don't let no one tell you, you cannot do it, because you can. That's right. You can. So I do music and I love it. And, um, you know, moving future with the band, you know, I don't see us, you know, having uh, any closure to this. Mm. Uh, we're expanding our horizon threat, Sydney, the yeah. north and south, the east and the west, as well as Illawarra and the central coast. Been around gigging for three years and we're celebrating our third year actually tonight. Um, you know, most of us are Greek, three of us, and um, you know, we've got three lead singers. Uh, it's a, a product that um, I haven't seen anything of it in the city, um, and we're actually nice guys. We're quite respectful. Uh, we talk to everybody. We're a people's band. We're not a egotistical driven band at all whatsoever. Uh, I'm a people's person, so I always network with uh, our fans and our followers through all our channels. So Facebook page, Rock City Saints. You can't miss us. The videos are there, like you mentioned. Yep. Uh, our links are there. Um, please come along. You won't be disappointed at all. And neither was I. I'm Michael Kalaris, and it was lovely to have you today. So Peter Spanish Thank at the Mitzellini Club. Thank you. Thank you. Nasakala. Tommy used to work on the docks Union's been on strike He's down on his luck, it's tough So tough Well, Gina works it down her all day Working for the man She brings on the pay for love For love 
She says we gotta hold on to what we've got. Doesn't make a difference if we make it or not. We've got each other. That's a love for love. Give it a shot. Whoa, we're halfway there. Whoa, living on a prayer. Take my hand, make it, I swear. Tommy's got his six ring in hock. He's down on his knees. We used to make it talk so tough. So tough. Mmm, Gina feels her running away. She cries in that town. Tell me, whispers, baby, it's okay. Someday. We gotta hold on to what we've got It doesn't make a difference if we make it or not We've got each other, that's a love for love we'll Give it a shot Whoa, we're halfway there Whoa, living on a prayer Take my hand, we'll make it, I swear Whoa, living on a prayer Take my hand, we'll make it, I swear Oh, living on 